being the president of a country is a dangerous job. No one knows this better than Vladimir Putin, who over 20 years has survived 43 different assassination attempts. Get ready to find out how Putin survived and how his six layers of security make him impossible to kill. Almost every year, Putin survives at least one assassination attempt. All of these experiences are partly why his security is so good, as they've had lots of training in real-life situations. Some of these assassination attempts were done very professionally, but thankfully for Putin, all of them were foiled. There was an attempt on Putin's life as soon as he became president back in 1999. This was by the Russian Mafia. Putin had begun cracking down on organized crime, which at the time was plaguing Russia. In retaliation, the Russian Mafia tried to bomb Putin's car. A bomb was planted, but Putin's security found it. Some of the Mafia members involved went to prison, while others were taken out. Later that year, Putin was almost assassinated in Uzbekistan. Uzbek militants planned to assassinate Putin while he was there on a state visit, but the plot was uncovered, and the militants were arrested. A year later in 2000, Chechen separatists planned to assassinate Putin during his visit. A remote control bomb was detonated near Putin's motorcade. Several of Putin's bodyguards were injured, but Putin himself survived. In 2002, Putin was almost assassinated using a jar of poisoned jam. He was set to have breakfast at a hotel in Crimea, but Putin's food testers discovered the poisoned jam before he ate it. Also in 2002, Putin went to a parade in Moscow's Red Square. In a nearby building, snipers were in position to take out Putin, but the Federal Protective Service, or FSO, caught wind of this and swiftly arrested the snipers. As if 2002 couldn't get worse for Putin, he was nearly assassinated again, this time during a trip to Azerbaijan. An Iraqi man with connections to Chechen separatists wanted to assassinate Putin. He planned to plant explosives under Putin's car. However, the Azerbaijani police discovered his plan. The man was soon arrested and later sentenced to 10 years in prison. The same year, another man tried to blow up Putin with a bomb. He planned to drive along the motorway next to Putin's motorcade and, from his car, detonate a 40-kilo explosive. Luckily for Putin, the FSO found out. They rerouted Putin's motorcade while at the same time ambushing and eliminating the would-be assassin. In 2003, Putin was nearly assassinated during a visit to the UK. Two Russian men planned to assassinate Putin with snipers, but they were arrested by British officers from SO-13, which is the UK's elite anti-terror police.